Hello and welcome. This is Gigi and this is a collective reading for all sign. Hey my collective, how are you? I hope you had a nice weekend. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe, like, and share the video. This is a general reading. I'm just going to say general, you guys, general. If it doesn't resonate, okay, leave it all behind, okay? Let's see what the message is. Energy reading, collective reading for my collective. Ooh. Okay, so there's a, here's, you remember I was telling you <clears throat> about this eclipse? An eclipse, it's always a, a woman leaves and another one comes in. Okay, so there's, here there's something, the reason why uh, the woman is leaving is due to lack of, lack of action. Nine of Wands could be lack of sexual action, lack of passion. Okay, I see this Queen of Cups here turning her back, this uh, Cancer Pisces Scorpio energy, it doesn't have to be, okay? Because your sun sign is what I call mundane astrology. You have to have your whole birth chart because that could be your Venus uh, place or your moon location. But this Queen of Cups represent the most loving energy, okay? As a woman. All right, so there's a very, very, very loving, very loved woman who's turning her back at this nine of wands, kind of immature energy, right? Page of wands here, okay? So something here wasn't going nowhere fast, okay? It wasn't going nowhere with the page of wands here. No communication, no action, all right? So I'm not sure if it's this divine feminine here who doesn't have not much going on, or it could be that, you know, maybe she wasn't pursued. I'm not sure. What is this energy? What does that mean? Queen of Cups spirit guide okay so this represent um a beautiful woman by the way this queen of cups she has this will of fortune oh no okay someone has decided to love themselves much 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 more all right will of fortune here this only major arcana uh blessing this reading blessing this queen of wands this queen of wands things are changing for her okay she has enough dealing with immature people here, immature men, immature collaboration, plans, creative project that wasn't going nowhere, or maybe she wasn't uh, pursuing anything. There's a will of fortune. There's someone here, okay? That could be you who's taking a chance. She's betting on herself, okay? So let's look deeper into this energy. Okay, things are changing because she is taking action for herself here, okay? So this is someone who's taking ownership. She's taking her own sovereignty here, okay? A five of pentacles after not even being supported. Wow, she was waiting for a long time. She has been delayed by maybe some family members here with this five of pentacles, people around her who was just not giving her any support. Maybe people did not want her to have anything, okay? Uh, it could be a woman who's been struggling, uh, coming from a very challenging house, home, family situation here. It's not better, but what she's gonna do is she's gonna better herself. She's not gonna wait for tradition, culture, doctrine uh whatever sustain or i should say sorry sustain whatever restrain her right pin her down five of pentacles prevent her to flourish nourish herself to feed herself feed her soul uh feed feed herself with love uh feed herself with care and forgiveness so there was really people in the background preventing her to grow and now what she's doing here with this energy is i see her clearly leaving things people place uh collaboration that that are really not worth s-h-i-t okay let's see wheel of fortune here Okay, so now this divine feminine, that could be you. Comment below the video. Let me know your situation. Someone here, there's a woman who's literally turning her back at something who really, honestly, wasn't on her level. Okay? All right? So now there's something that happened in her mind, some type of a change, 
of fortune here, something that triggered. Could be because it's her time, could be because of astrology. Ace of Cups in a reverse. She is not giving to nobody anymore. She's going to give to herself. So this Queen of Cups, like I could see like a little, I, I feel like someone's been a little bit abused here, okay? Okay, because ignoring a family member perpetually uh, extrising someone by rejection, by um, uh, removing them, okay, excluding them, that actually, you know, let me tell you, that actually could break someone, all right, Ace of Cups, until someone turned their back, and what happened, this Wheel of Fortune for me is a boomerang effect, all right, it's a boomerang effect when whatever you push out to someone for years, ostracizing her, rejecting her, because sometimes a lot of things, a lot of times family members do that to each other. And that's why I'm saying, you guys, if that's the case, all right, your family member or your 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 uh, neighborhood, the surrounding around you is not supporting. If you can, please reach out to uh, some outside people or just... You know, there's a lot of opportunity here that teaches you how to really leave a situation. All right. I'm talking to my divine feminine here. Ace of Cups in the reverse. There's no love in a house, in a home, in a family. There's just no love. And this Queen of Cups, if she don't have love, that, like I said, it could literally drive someone mad. Not getting love for no reason. Being rejected, abandoned. So someone here with this... Will of Fortune is changing her own fate due to the lack of love, due to lack of a strong foundation for someone to be able to feel secure, to feel love, to feel value, okay? Which is it, every human being legitimate right to be valued, okay? Ten of Cups is also in a reverse. So talking about that, so there's a definite... Something about some 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 insecurity here is family here. Ten of Pentacles is in a reverse. There's a woman who was not supported here. Okay, at the present time, she's triggering some type of change in her own life to change her situation. Right? She's changing her. She's she's she self. She's saving herself because I don't see any support around that right now. Ten of Pentacles in a reverse. Spirit guys, Three of Swords. Right, in a reverse, all right? So enough crying. It's it's done, okay? So for those of you guys that, that have been, you know, because sometimes your own community could make you believe that people have to do this for each other. People, you have to force to do that. You need, it, no, actually, you know what? It's, it's, it's based on false doctrine. If you are not supported, if you are not loved, you are not protected. You cannot turn around and give that to other people. All right? It is not your responsibility to do that for other people, for your family. If they are not able, sometimes they're not able and you're the strongest one you might have. If, if, if that was how you were raised, if that's how your, your upbringing was, that they taught you, help each other, other people came in and they help you and you help them. If that's how you were brought up, then of course, naturally, it's going to flow. But if that wasn't how you were brought up and you're a grown person, it is time for you to trigger your own destiny. Fate is calling. All right? Fate is calling. Queen of Cups with this will of fortune because there's nothing. There's nothing in whatever situation here. Ten of Pentacles that represent inheritance. All right, chess or chest of value, worth, people, things that are important, people that leave things, the wisdom, the the memories. Okay, if it's not on a physical, um, tangible, tangent, tangent, tangent. Okay, okay, forget it. All right, ten of pentacles. If it's not on a physical, like something you can hold, you know, it could be your health. So you know, so maybe your family taught you how to. A care for yourself, how to remain healthy, what to do when you're sick, they give you hint, they, they help you, they give you wisdom. But if it wasn't there, and they have the three of swords in a reverse, it's still less uh less heartbreaking, all right? But it's a heartbreak. If it's if it takes you for a long time for you to 
pull yourself out of this situation so you can get clarity to know that I don't want to be in a hole. I don't want to uh, be pinned down by things that are not supporting my whole being, myself, my life. All right, so this is a huge transformation happening for a divine feminine. And for guys, remember, we all have a feminine energy. Where we both we have both men and women, feminine and masculine energy. But I'm hearing like the me street, the miss maltreatment, Toro life is over. Will of Fortune. I need more with Will of Fortune and Queen of Cups here. Right. Someone made a lot of uh, sacrifice. They or they were expecting this Queen of Cups to sacrifice a whole life. Uh, are they for real? This this uh family setting community was expecting this young woman here to sacrifice herself, her life, her dream, her wish. Wow. Okay. Seven of Swords, right, due to jealousy, all right? What's happening is this Queen of Cups has something that other women or other people in her family doesn't have. I'm sorry, but sibling rivalry is a fact, and it comes from ages, like back, back, look at the Bible, all those stories about those siblings, all right, trying to kill each other, all right? Seven of Swords. So now I'm not saying it's sibling, but there's a lot of energy in Gemini. Gemini represent neighbor, cousins, siblings. All right. So there's someone in, in some sort of like an approach. Uh, I should say approach. That's not the word. I'm mixing French and English. There's some type of closeness between that, this, this jealous energy and this queen of cups. All right. It's like, I feel like this queen of cups not, is not aware that there's someone who's breathing down her neck who's really blocking path for her like just behind because you know if someone has has power to do that you have to check into it but this will of fortune says there's something that's going to change but let me tell you my divine feminine as i said i keep saying in my video <clears throat> we need to mentor each other i want to mentor women i want to tell them we younger women okay if you see yourself at this point in your life you don't have any friends you're alone, you're not blended. Let me tell you, I was like that in my 20s as well, all right? I had internet, we had internet, we're lucky now. There's so many things, work on your own skills, get knowledge, build your confidence, build your own platform, all right? And remember, rejection is God protection. Go watch videos about those little girls or those girls that go parties, get drugged, or, you know, this, this, uh, they get into this and then they make a video, they regret it, everybody make mistakes. But sometimes when you're vulnerable, and especially at a young age, women in your 20s, all you have are images and you don't really have enough experience to know that whatever you see is not truly what that is. All right, so find yourself. If that is where you are in your life, if you're a young, beautiful woman, queen of cups, take control, be mindful, have boundaries. Not everybody, is is uh is worth your time protect yourself all right less is more i think we need to all women i'm going to use my platform to support other women of course i want to support everybody but i also like i said i was also a young woman who was somehow rejected by my family and if it wasn't for internet and other women and membership so i could come out of it come out of my closet come out and this shame that it's nothing that I did and nothing that you ladies do sometimes is some 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 type of uh, karmic baggage that we have to carry a cross that we have to carry but you don't have to will of fortune says the time are changing release yourself because I wouldn't want to see any woman because of not having a strong support to fall into all those traps that are there for women to fall to. And if you have fallen into those, those traps, it says here, you're going to pull yourself out. Do you pull yourself out. You can pull yourself out. 
if you need help i'm here and there's a lot of people on this platform that can help you okay will of fortune you guys with this queen of cups tell me more what's the message will of fortune Queen of Pentacles, exactly. That's your support here. Mentorship, other women, speak, listen. Don't just think that going out, being uh, be with a bunch of people, and you see those songs now. I hear them on Spotify. I just want to smoke and high and have sex. I just want to fuck. I'm telling you, you don't, and then if, if that's not what you're into, you don't have to be telling yourself, what am I doing? I'm not doing enough. I'm not attracting people. I'm not, you are exactly what you need, to, who you need to, to be. And you are what the most high wants you to be. Okay. So queen of pentacles here, ask for support. Ladies, ask for support. Seven of swords. This is my jealous. It's Venus in the 11th house is someone around you close to you and might be a mother figure and might be a neighbor might be a friend someone who's jealous of you all right who could have never given you nothing ace of cups in the reverse with five of pentacles and you thought for a while that that's what you were supposed to get no 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 now there's some some type of illumination that's going to happen with this eclipse between scorpio and and taurus where you're going to find your worth. A lot of women is going to be finding your their worth. Okay? Because of them creating strong boundaries. Boundaries is healthy. And I've been saying that to my video. When someone asks you or talk to you. They ask you for your name and number. You're not supposed to give it to them. You don't know them. Even if you find them interesting or attractive. It takes time to trust. And that's what you need to do. Okay? You can exchange emails, you know, like have a boundaries, but give them access to you. Be very, very mindful. Okay. There's a lot of trick trickster here. Okay. And they could prey on you, especially if, if you, 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 you could confine in someone not knowing who for you can confine in the wrong people and they could tell, they could see that you don't have the support and set you up and take something from you or try to hurt you because you know, here someone values someone. There's other people around that divine family that is under the impression that she don't know her work. But the Queen of Cups would have, the Queen of Pentacles, she does. <coughs> and someone else who represent worth, this Queen of Pentacles, she represent worth, value, knows this Queen of Cups. So you have a strong ally. Reach out for for. Uh, for other women, even if they're young, older than you, okay? I'm going to end this reading here. Let me know how this resonates with you. Until next time, send you lots of kisses. Love you.